Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have been tagged by the beauty puzzle Linda um, to do the sweater weather tag. And I haven't done the tag because A, no one's tagged me, <laughs> but that hasn't stopped me before. Um, but also it's just, I love fall, but the typical things about fall, I don't really have an answer for um, because I'm like all about summer and winter. Not so much winter, but more Christmas. Like this time of year, I'm like, let's decorate the house. Let's put on fuzzy red Santa hats. Let's go. <laughs> just all about it. So, um, so some of my answers may not be up to par. Just letting you know. But I figured I was tagged. I'm doing it. So I have my iPad here with all the questions. The first one is, what's my favorite candle scent? And this is another one. I don't have a favorite fall scent. Um, like a specific candle. The candle that I'm loving... Oh, all month was um, this, and this is like a like a Christmas candle, but this is Land of Candy Aroma Beads Cupcake Castle, and I got this at Rite Aid. Um, Nouveau Cheap actually posted this. I saw it on Instagram, and then I saw on her blog um, that these were available, and I never would have seen them otherwise. It's like I, I remember looking and reading and everything, and then I saw it at Rite Aid, and oh, it smells so good. My husband started burning it. Some kind of like crazy white bird just flew by my window, like low. That was really weird. This smells so good. It smells like cupcakes. Basically any kind of sweet, warm vanilla scent is right up there with pumpkin. My house, this little tiny jar makes my whole entire house smell like yummy goodness. So even though it's not roasted marshmallows or leaves or whatever, you know, autumn is supposed to smell like, this is how I want my house to smell year round. So that's my favorite candle scent right now. Um, sorry, it's not super fall. Next, coffee, tea, or hot chocolate? I am all about coffee. Um, I actually just watched this tag that a brunette duet did and hilarious. They were like coffee, year round, cold, warm, night, day. It doesn't matter, like coffee's the way to go. Yeah, I'm a coffee girl. I'm from New England. You know, Boston runs on Dunkin's. That's what we say, <laughs> you know, and I love Dunkin' Donuts. We have at my job, um, we get like the Keurig coffee. So it's like, I can't complain. It's free and it's great. So I always have like half French vanilla and then half decaf in the morning. And then I'll have like my second cup by two because after three o'clock, I don't want to have any kind of coffee because it will keep me up all night. So I try to limit it, but I just love me some coffee and in the summer iced coffee and right now it's freezing outside and gray and rainy and I still want iced coffee. I don't care. 100% I'm a coffee girl. I also grew up on coffee like my dad's company sells a, a lot of uh, different different types of merchandise to stores and um, you know all different things and coffee was like their main product it was Bustelo coffee uh, any of my Latin ladies out there might have heard of it so I grew up on Bustelo coffee like when I was really, really little. Maybe that's why I'm so darn short, but whatever. Um, what's your best fall memory? <sighs> the only thing to me that screams fall is when we were little. I have three siblings. And when we were really little, my dad would rake all the leaves in the yard. And it's so gross now that I think about it because the leaves are like wet and nasty. But we would just like jump in the leaf piles. And it was just like so fun. And it's just amazing. Like like four grown kids would just be jumping and like we would never hit the bottom because those piles were so darn big. But I just, I loved that. And it was like cement underneath. So definitely injuries could have ensued. But I do, I just remember, you, I mean, everything kind of led up to Christmas and we're like really big on Christmas and that's my dad's birthday. But the fall was just like about preparing for Christmas and going to school. But like, I don't know, those leaf piles, they just, they get me every time every time uh which makeup trend do you prefer dark lips or winged liner because i suck at winged liner it's always going to be my lips dark bright i mean you guys know how i am <laughs> so in those days where i like wing out my eyes with shadow or with just smudging out like a wing i'll still wear dark lips or bright lips you know the more the merrier you only live once and i don't want my last regret to be that i didn't rock a bold lip and a winged eye just saying best fragrance for fall I love, I love my Prada candy. It does not matter. I got that over the summer and it's sweet, but it's not like 13 year old girl sweet. No offense if you're 13, but I'm 31. <laughs> you know, I don't want to smell like a 13 year old. 
and it is sweet but but sophisticated and sexy and like a little bit of spice in there and oh i love prada candy i also actually just smelled joe malone it's like english pear and freesia i think it is my co-worker um I had sprayed it and I could just smell it a cubicle away. It smelled amazing and she got me two little samples. Oh, I like leave them at my desk because that's amazing. I have to buy it. I know I'm going to end up buying that scent, but so I would say Prada candy because that's what I have in like an actual bottle and can be liberal with. But my little special one I'm currently obsessed with like the last week or two is Jo Malone. Um, my favorite Thanksgiving food. Gravy. <laughs> I know it sounds so random. But everything is better with gravy. I don't like cranberry sauce. So I love stuffing, but I don't like chunks of vegetables. So I hate that I could like bite down into an onion or a piece of celery, you know. But it's like I put gravy on everything. It goes on biscuits, which is like right up there. Um, obviously on the turkey, on the mashed potatoes, on, on anything. Gravy makes everything better. It's just so delicious. It's not Thanksgiving. To me, it's not Thanksgiving if there's not gravy. Then it's just like a really nice turkey meal. I don't know. That's just me. Um, what's autumn like where I live? Autumn is all over the place. My battery's about to die, so if it shuts off, I will come back momentarily. But autumn's all over the place. Like I said, I'm in Boston and uh, the Boston area. And <sighs> I mean, late September, it was super warm. We had days where it was like 70 degrees. And then... A day or two later it would be 40 and right now you know this week it was like 20 degrees and ridiculously windy it was like zero degrees with the wind chill and now it's like freezing and crazy rainstorms but you know last week it was 60 degrees and I was like wearing a light jacket and holding it not even wearing it you know so Autumn is just kind of all over the place. It's already snowed twice, nothing that's stuck, but still, and we still have really sunny days. So we have no typical, you know, any season. It's never typical other than winter where we know we're going to have like 60 degree weather and then 20 feet of snow the next day. But such is life in New England. Um, the next one, sorry, I keep looking down guys. That must look so annoying. My most worn sweater, I don't really have one, but I did just get this sweater from Forever 21. Sorry, I know the lighting sucks. I'm probably gonna post pictures on my blog, but um, I think it was like $21 or something, but it's just like this cream color with this like rose gold, you know, kind of woven in, and it's just so pretty. So this is just kind of a representation of the sweaters that I'm currently obsessed with, and I'm just really big on it, and it's, classy for work but then it's like with jeans and snipe <laughs> then with jeans and like some fuzzy boots it's very wintry so i'm loving this look in general my must have nail polish for fall i'm gonna say it this was in my favorites it's the revlon perfumery in bordeaux it's just this really nice deep bordeaux wine color gorgeous with some gold accents i'm just all about these deep jewel tones in the fall basically jewel of an eye sonia kashuk on my nails on my clothes, on my eyes, lips, everything. Those are the colors that I'm going to gravitate towards. Um, football games are jumping in leaf piles. I would say I want to jump in a leaf pile during halftime or whatever it's called. You know, like I, I like football in general. Um, I'm not a specific fan where I know all the rules and all the players. Love the Pats, any team from New England. I support hardcore, um, but I like the whole feel of food and a tree and the pats playing and, you know, it's just everything. But then, you know, on a little break, let's go jump in a leaf pile and have hot cocoa and all that good stuff. So kind of a blend of both worlds. Let me see. Skinny jeans or leggings. All right. I'm a little thicker on the bottom. So in my house, leggings. In public, skinny jeans. And if it's skinny jeans, they're going to be with like some kind of mid-calf boot, uh, flat boot, something really warm or like Uggs or something like that just because it keeps my feet warm and my feet are always cold. And then combat boots or Uggs. I have Uggs because my husband has gotten them for me. I've never purchased any on my own. Um, but I'm kind of getting into combat boots and I actually have some that just got delivered to my sister's house. So I'm going to have to 
get used to those and I'm probably gonna post pictures again on my blog uh, just because it's not worth like a whole video to show you like two pairs of boots and the next question is is pumpkin spice worth the hype yes <laughs> um, I, and yes I was a cheerleader in high school I love pumpkin everything it's just the spice of life um, I know that there's like a, a net what nest cafe like pumpkin creamer I heard it's really good I really kind of have no desire to taste that I know there's a pumpkin eggnog kind of have no desire to taste that I don't really so much like pumpkin flavored things other than coffee I like pumpkin things like I love pumpkin pie pumpkin bread a pumpkin donut things like that but it's like I don't need you know my creamer to taste like pumpkin I want the coffee to taste like I don't know it's just I think there's a difference between like a pumpkin spice and then something being art super artificially pumpkin flavored and I think that's my deal but yes I love pumpkin uh, just anything other than a scent I don't want to smell like it like a perfume but I love pumpkin it's so warm and cozy and uh, uh, I just I love it I really do I bought into the hype a long time ago um, favorite fall TV show come on guys there's too many let's go starting on Sundays Walking Dead gotta go for it Dexter and Breaking Bad are over so now we moved on Walking Dead Tuesdays Sons of Anarchy Thursdays Scandal everything else I mean there's a few other good shows that we're kind of getting into but me and my husband Sons of Anarchy and Scandal all the way I have yet to get him addicted to Walking Dead and I do love Once Upon a Time but those are my favorite shows and if I had to pick one I mean I cannot go a day late watching Scandal it's like if you guys aren't obsessed what are you doing what are you doing with your lives I want to be Olivia Pope I want to wear white all day long <laughs> it's just such a good show and the last question is what song really gets you into the fall spirit guys I don't have one there's not a song that like gets me into the fall mood I don't really listen to like alternative music or like indie the other sweater weather tags I've watched it seems like they're more kind of songs like that that remind people of fall but I listen to R&B and you know like 94.5 and Kiss 108 and <laughs> anyone who lives in my area knows but you know so I don't really know any fall like songs there are songs that came out in the fall but they don't remind me of fall. When I think of seasonal music, I think of Christmas. When I think of Christmas music, I think of Feliz Navidad. <laughs> Super corny, but I do. And my favorite, Mariah Carey, All I Want for Christmas is You. That's my mom's song and my song. And it's just like every year we like listen to it and cry and just memories, you know, so... I don't know right about this time like some of our stations start playing Christmas music and I've heard that like 800 times already oh and there's also that Bon Jovi one like bells will be ringing guys I have the worst voice I don't know any of the rest of the words either but I do love Christmas and to me November means turkeys and Christmas so <laughs> that's that's it I don't have like an actual fall song but um but yeah, if you do, comment down below and let me know your favorite fall song so I can listen to it while it's still fall, even though the weather here is leaning more towards winter. But that's it. That's all I got for the sweater weather tag. Then Linda, thank you so much for tagging me. And I'm sorry, guys, that my sweater weather tag was definitely about sweaters and sweater weather, but leaning more towards winter. And that's just it. Like where I am, we kind of go, so it just seems like sometimes we skip over fall and spring. We go to the extremes and that's kind of where we are right now. So that's it. If you want to respond to this tag with your own video, comment down below so I know when I can check your video out. I tag all of you. I don't even know which one of my friends have or have not done it. But anyone else just definitely check it out you know it's kind of it's always fun to do these little tags and see what you have in common or the opposite of other people that that you you know watch and are interested in it kind of gives us a little peek into each other's lives a little bit more other than just makeup don't forget to stay blessed and stay beautiful and always 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 regardless of the day or the holiday be thankful for what you have because it could be gone in an instant and we're all very blessed to have whatever we do have even if it doesn't seem like a lot at times so just Keep counting your blessings and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.